Allow me to start this video off by showing you guys a very special thing. If I can just go down here, you guys have already seen it, but... BEANS! Hiya Barkers, I'm Jalen Falf, and I'm back in VR chat with another Reading Your Comments video. This time, we're just gonna go back through a few more videos. I know the upload schedule has been a little bit lacking as of late, and I know it's because of a change in schedule from Mondays and Fridays to just Fridays now, because again, I'm running out of content for this channel. So I have some holdover content in place. And with Planet Coaster almost done, the end of the YouTube channel is a, is a nigh. So, why not celebrate one more time with an, one final reading of comments? At least, for now. No, this is definitely going to be the very last reading of comments video for this YouTube channel. We're so close to being done with this channel. I still have the Planet Coaster video to put out. Well, videos because there's going to be a reveal for who's on it, and the actual Ride the Rides moment. You might have a surprise for the Ride the Rides moment, but you never know. So, this is also going to be a reminder that even though the channel is dying, 2022 is going to have a few more content up ahead. Maybe some sparse random here and there, but no longer going to be on a schedule. It's going to be random. I said it, it's going to be random, and if it is, the Fridays are usual. So, without further ado, on to the comments. I definitely say that your transition is going to be promising no matter what. I, of course, do want to grow my YouTube once I've got my own setup in my own place. I will definitely say I'll do my best now and then to drop by. Also, yes, I know my comments are so often shown since there are some witty stuff I say now and then. I don't know, though. I'm just a curl. I don't know why your comments keep up, keep being so witty at times, man. I'm just dog. I'm still proud of my blue, blue, uh, can I please speak today? Thank you. I'm still proud of my blue brother for finally admitting he's cute. Proud of you, Jalen. Still love it when that happens, too, when Destiny joins us. Oh, right. The old, um, yeah, I know what you're talking about. That thing. And I'm actually pointing in the right direction for once, because this is where I'm facing in my room. Yeah, I... The names and everything alongside that thing's triggers, it... What can you do, man? What can you do? She even goes off when I say, when I say certain things that sound close to it. Any upgrade to security is the best move to make anywhere. Indeed. Like I said in that video. At the time that I made that video, I was working for G4S, which was, at the time, one of the biggest security companies worldwide. Since then, the North America division has been bought out by Allied Universal Solutions, and my job has been eliminated. So, I am no longer working. But, that doesn't mean I can't make content for you guys with the stuff that I still have now. A lot of things may still be changing for me life-wise, but that, but that doesn't mean my content will. Let's go, another video. Love the content. Hey, gotta love when somebody loves the content. Uh, makes me feel happy too, knowing that somebody actually appreciates my work. Uh, Foot, are you okay? Foot, can you work with me here? Also, speaking of tracking, when I put my... When I put my... Oh, God, there I go! <sighs> you know, that was quite the experience. Went full body. Better be prepared for those out-of-body experiences. You never know when they're gonna come. Happy that cons are back in action on a good level in spite of COVID. Well, we still have to live with it. And, of course, cons have to adapt to it as well. Megaplex did have to limit their... their um attendance because of the pandemic. This was so well done and it's only for day one, so I get to watch an entire series of what you recorded. Oh my god, so much quality stuff. You are best cameraman of the fandom. Not exactly. 
There are others out there. I don't like to compare myself, but I like opinions. I just don't think my I don't don't think I myself feel like the best in general. It's just not me. Neon in a thumbnail? Heck yeah, Neon is such a good bean. I'll give you a spoiler. While I was recording Neon, I had to cut after his awu because sometime after his awu, he started talking politics relating to Florida politics. And that's when I was suddenly like, okay, that's enough. I don't want that in my video. Besides, cons are about just enjoying yourself, not sharing your opinions with anybody else, your, po your, your, your politics, whatever problems you have in the fandom. You're just here to have fun. You're just there to have fun. And if you have problems with somebody and you know they're going, try to distance yourself. Best words I know from a certain gray muzzle, certain by the name of Sonic Got. Best person I know. I need help on making sea roots. Any tips will be appreciated. Well, for Zeus and Poseidon, um, the best approach. Um, think about this. You're thinking of your city in which you're thinking of where the cities are in comparison with each other. And the best approach to making that. Sea routes are automatic when you're thinking of something like an island. Land routes are also automatic. There is no... As far as I'm aware, there's no real way to change that other than just placing your cities in different locations. Once that trade system is up, then some things can happen. Trust me, I've seen it. That, my friend, is actually a serval, a.k.a. Leggy Kitty. Other than that, not a bad loot box thingy. Yes. Yes. Uh, this is Furry Mystery Box. Again, great. There are other furry loot boxes out there. Furry Mystery Box was just pretty much the only one that was at Megaplex at the time I got it. So that's why I got a video on it. Any other furry box like... Uh I'm trying to remember the others. With any others, I'm pretty sure that there's going to be some quality in those boxes. And everyone is basically themed. This one happened to be a theme, and I just chose not to continue the subscription. Because I had other subscriptions to worry about. And money was tight. True story. Zoomies? Yes. Coasters do go the zoom. How does this only have 23 views with around 3k subs? I've been evaluating my statistics. People lose interest all the time, and, and many times people do forget they're subscribed to a person. Why do I say this? In the past, YouTube has had problems with subscription feeds and everything, as well as notifications going out. This is why I keep telling you guys when you subscribe, please make sure you ring the notification bell, as is this icon over here is going to probably tell you right about now, just so you get the notifications. There's also a little subscriptions feed which you can actually go to, to, to see where your subscriptions are, and they sort it by latest upload. Helps you out when you're trying to find the right kind of video. But I also tweet out my videos so you guys don't miss a thing. At this time, I get attacked by Chucky. Chucky is gonna get you, Silver. You never know. The update looks cool. Yes, Trax does have impressive work. I mean, I I do kind of wish that the passenger thing was a bit longer so I could make more videos on it. And there was an option to use the workshops so that I could freely go through the creations that people make just so that it's a thing. But of course, roadmaps are a thing. And who knows? Maybe we'll see workshop content for Tracks the Train Set game down the line. You know. So that, that sort of thing. And I actually dis I actually disliked this particular con content for good reason, but I can answer this one anyways. Are you allergic to the boost button? And I have a good reason for this. I'm not a speedrunner. There are certain points in distance, as well as the, de the uh, extra content that you have in the game, that boosting isn't necessarily necessary. Although time constraints can allow you to boost when the time gets tight, but truthfully, you don't really need boosts at all. It's just there for convenience and certain puzzles. I fall in midair constantly. It's super annoying. Don't you just love the video game bugs? I know I do. 
Twitch Highlights has some of my favorites from that as well. Also, did anybody notice that cute kitty in the background over here? This screen has some good content. Of course protogens can drive trains. They're anthropomorphic furry robots. Yes! If you can train them to drive them. Thank you, I'll be here all week. But yes, yeah, since that video actually released, I have since passed signaler training on Stepford County Railway, and am excited to reveal that on that in 2022 to start off my streaming career, I will be chill I will be chill streaming a signaling session on any of the six zones in Stepford County Railway, my choice, while talking with you guys. It's a nice way for me to get to know my viewers, get to chillax with you guys, and just vibe out while I get back into the groove of streaming. And especially to uh, let you guys get a feel for how I do things, or how we do things on uh, that network. And especially when it comes to ga other games too. I know there's another game that... Um, there's a train signaling game out there that actually simulates real life train signaling and I forgot what the name of that was. I can have editing Jalen put that in the video in the video somewhere around me just so um just so um I can remind myself what it is. But if he doesn't, feel free to post it down in the comments. Hey, creep up the great work, hon. I'm behind you 100 percent Again, I have trouble I have struggles with the heart on this model. Maybe I have a model that can do something different. Let me have a, let me see if I can find a model that does that. Hang on. Hmm, maybe the Rex can probably do that. Oh heck, yes. The Rex can actually do that. My hearts are going out to all of you guys. Oh my god, can I not grab the camera, please? Yes, my hearts going out to all of you and you are awesome. With that said, I'd like to thank you all so much for coming on in to this reading your comments session. And I cannot wait for more. A. Beans, get out of the face. This is meat time. And since it is meat time, why don't I take this baby up close and personal? If I can actually grab this correctly. I can actually. There we go. Yeah, this is a good opportunity to get my get my good face on because this is a great moment to end the video with. This is... Oh, can I autofocus on this, actually? Eh, I don't need the focus for this video. But yeah, I'm sorry for the close-up. I really do need to give you the good vibes for this and for the end of this video. You guys are so hecking amazing, and I cannot wait to come back for more good content, even if it is on Twitch. This may be the final reading your comments, and this may be one of the very last videos that you'll see on this channel, but hey, it was worth the ride. And I cannot wait to see you guys over on Twitch. It'll be awesome. Anyway, thank you guys so much for watching. If you liked what you saw, leave a like, post your comments, hit subscribe to the notification bell, share this video with your friends. And as always, I'll catch you guys in the next one. Until next time, everybody. Let's go!